Hello YouTube. Well, I've been saying it forever, and I finally got one of my new boas. I'm so freaking hyped. This is my Super Salmon Jungle Het Albino. Uh, that means he's a dominant salmon, so every baby he produces, no matter if it's to a normal uh, or what, uh, they'll be at least salmon. And then with Jungle, it's a co-dominant trait, so half the babies that come out of any litter of his should have Jungle. And he's also 100% Het Albino. So if you breed him to an albino, you'll get half albinos and half hets. If you breed him to a normal, you'd get all 50-50 uh, albinos, means each have a 50% chance of being an albino. And then uh, the last situation would be to breed to another het, you would get, uh, let's see, a quarter of them would be albino, and then the other three quarters each would have a two-thirds chance of being a het albino. If you want to know more about the genetics, let me know. Um, there's also a ton of stuff on the web. But let's peek in here and see what's going on with my dude. He's in the back corner, and I really don't want to mess with him too much because he's coming into shed. So on top of that, his colors won't be the best. But this is his first night staying here, so I want to make sure he's okay in the morning. I'm going to pull out this. He's all the way tucked in that back corner. I want to be gentle. And there he is. See, his eyes are really, really cloudy, so I don't want to reach in there too much. I don't want to scare him, but oops, let's zoom out. I'm going to show you his tail. Oh, it looks like he's kind of pissed. He might strike out at me. But it's okay. Come on, buddy. Oh, oh I think he's so badass. Hey, there you go. See, look at this. Look at this little butte. I'll just put him down in the front. There you go. Look at that awesome little stripe down his back. See, his colors are really dull right now. You can see his eyes. How they're. Oops. They're kind of cloudy. Like he, it's not really clear or whatever. That's a really easy indicator for a snake being in shed. But look at this tail. Look at how beautiful that is. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm coming over a cold. Um, but yeah, so there's like no, almost no black in there. And that's really significant of a super uh, salmon. Basically, the salmon trait is a form of hypomelanism, which means it reduces the black pigmentation in the animal. Since it's a co-dominant trait, you have uh, the normal um, salmon, which is at the heterozygous level, where they get just one salmon allele from a parent. And then you have the dominant or super form, and that's where both parents provide the salmon allele. And when that happens, you have a huge reduction in black in the animal, uh, where there's almost no black fleckling, and it really shows in the tail just how clean that is. Like, you just barely see a black scale here and there. But uh, this is my little guy, and once I get, or once he gets out of shed, I'll post some more video, and you guys are just going to freak. I'll, I'll pull him into some sunlight so you can see uh, his real color start to shine through. His true colors. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <clears throat> well, hope you like. And uh, that's George. George of the jungle. <laughs>